Hello friends, myself Amar and uh, in this video I will discuss how to uh, design or how to style report element based on condition. Now if you see this output here what I have done the students for whom the marks is greater than 500 the background color is red and for the students where marks is less than 500 the background color is red. How it can be done, how the conditional formatting can be done that portion I will discuss today. Okay. Now if you go to designer here, here simply I have taken these fields name, marks and division and from the palette, go to palette, from this palette I have taken a rectangle, inside the rectangle I have taken these fields, if you see this is the rectangle, inside this rectangle I have taken all these fields, okay. Now here I need to create a condition based on which the color will change and to do that what I have done. Here we have styles, here I have created two styles, oh sorry one style, style one, okay. How to create this style, simply right click here, add and click on style, okay. This style will be generated. Now inside this style, what I have done, I have created two uh, conditional styles and to do that, simply I have right click here, add conditional style, okay. For the first one, this is the first conditional style and I have added second conditional style. Now if you click here and go to edit condition then what I have done from here I have taken the field that is uh, marks okay and here I have given a condition marks is greater than 500 I have created one condition and similarly for this for this marks field I have created a condition where the marks is less than 500 okay let me show you how to create the conditional style simply right click here add conditional style and after that here right click edit condition okay now from here you choose the column fields and specify the double click here and specify the condition which you want to specify okay in my case i have created two styles where for one case the marks is greater than 500 and for one case the marks is less than 500 okay now if the marks is greater than 500 then the background color of rectangle will change to green else the background color will change to red okay and to do that you need to go to xml and here if you see this conditional style which we have created this conditional style is generated this conditional expression will be generated automatically now here in this style you need to specify the back color back color i have specified as green and for the second condition the back color i have specified as red okay now this style you need to specify how to specify simply select the rectangle go to properties and here you will get option style from here you choose the style which we have created the style which we have created the name is style one okay so i have chosen this style one right now one more thing i will say that go to xml for the rectangle where i am applying the style if it has a default background color then that default background color will override the style to solve that problem in the rectangle if you are seeing any background back color property here just remove that back color property okay and now you can preview the data and you will get this output okay this is how we can create conditional formatting or conditional reporting based on condition i have changed the style of the reporting elements okay if you like my video please subscribe my channel thank you so much